about to be 15 or 16 years old. Charles LeBlanc is no stranger to the news. He reports it in his own unique and plain-spoken way in a blog, and he makes it the same way, challenging the police and politicians. Well, today, an independent review has passed judgment on the seizure of his computer by the Fredericton police. And in his same plain-spoken way, the blogger says the matter still isn't settled. CTV's Nick Moore tonight. I, I haven't been the same Charles LeBlanc, and I probably never will be. But one thing that has not changed is Charles LeBlanc's drive to blog, even if it's about a police review centered around him. A review of procedures after police seized LeBlanc's computer in anticipation of a criminal libel charge after LeBlanc made comments about a constable on his blog. In terms of the, of the investigation itself, generally it was uh, carried out according to uh, the, the high standards. Former Ombudsman Bernard Richard carried out the review, laying out seven recommendations, including more training for officers in dealing with whom he called challenging members of the public. That there are members of the public that provide particular challenges to policing. When this review was announced in May, then Police Chief Barry McKnight said community trust was critical in order for officers to do their job. About a month later, McKnight finished the paperwork which allowed for his own early retirement. The acting police chief said the force accepted every recommendation. Also will follow up with any necessary training, both with respect to um, dealing with emotionally disturbed persons, persons with uh, special challenges. LeBlanc's lawyer said the review focused more on the blogger's persona and less on claims that police targeted him. He was the one who had eight people on his doorstep. He was the one who, who lost his computer for three months. LeBlanc's history with police is long and extensive. In 2006, St. John police charged him with obstructing justice for taking pictures at a protest, charges a judge threw out. He's been arrested twice for being on the grounds of the provincial legislature where he's banned. In Fredericton police charged him with causing a disturbance in front of their station last year, a situation which led to the libel investigation and today's review. Does this, this make me afraid of the French police force? No. I'm more angry. Anger that LeBlanc says may lead to a financial lawsuit against the city's police. Nick Moore, CTV News, Fredericton. Still ahead on CTV News tonight, we look into this idea of maritime union and